Fluconazole is a type of antifungal medication that is commonly prescribed to treat various fungal infections. It is often used to treat yeast infections, such as thrush, as well as other fungal infections, including ringworm, jock itch, and athlete's foot. Fluconazole is beneficial for treating fungal infections because it is very effective in stopping the growth of the fungi that cause the condition. It is fast-acting and can start to provide relief from symptoms within a few days of treatment. In addition, fluconazole is available in both oral tablet and intravenous form, making it accessible to treat infections in individuals of all ages. This article will explore the various uses and benefits of fluconazole and how it can be used to treat fungal infections. Overview of fluconazole Fluconazole is an antifungal medication that is used to treat various fungal infections. It is the most widely prescribed antifungal medication in the world and can be used to treat common fungal infections, such as thrush, jock itch, and ringworm. Fluconazole is available in both tablet and intravenous IV, forms and it can treat a wide range of infections caused by different types of fungi. Fluconazole is an oral antifungal medication that is commonly prescribed to treat vaginal infections caused by a type of fungus called candida. Oral antifungal medications work best for treating vaginal infections, since they can be taken easily at home without requiring an invasive procedure. Oral antifungal medications such as fluconazole work by killing the candida fungus and restoring the balance of bacteria within the vagina. What is fluconazole used for? Fluconazole can be used to treat a range of fungal infections, including thrush, a vaginal infection caused by a type of yeast, jock itch, ringworm, and athlete's foot. It can also be used to treat serious fungal infections, such as cryptococcal meningitis and disseminated histoplasmosis, when other antifungal treatments are not effective enough. Thrush. Vaginal infection. Fluconazole is an oral antifungal drug that is commonly prescribed to treat vaginal infections caused by candida. It is a very common fungal infection in women and can affect people of all ages. This common yeast-related infection is usually found in the vagina and or the skin around the vagina and causes itching, burning, and discharge. Jock itch. Fungal infection on skin. Jock itch, also called tinea cruris, is a fungal infection of the skin on and around the genitals, the inner thighs, and sometimes the buttocks. Commonly, it affects men and boys who sweat a lot, such as athletes and people who have a job that requires them to be physically active. Jock itch is most commonly caused by a type of fungus called trichophyton. Fluconazole is often used to treat jock itch, as it is an effective antifungal medication. Ringworm. Fungal infection on skin. Ringworm is a skin condition that is caused by a type of fungus called dermatophytes, which is found in soil, dust, and animals. It is most commonly found on the scalp, hands, feet, knees, and elbows. It can also affect the genitals, the inside of the mouth, and other areas. Fluconazole can be used to treat ringworm of the scalp and certain types of ringworm of the skin. Cryptococcal meningitis. Fungal infection in the brain. Cryptococcal meningitis is a serious infection of the brain caused by a type of fungus called cryptococcus. It is found in some tropical and subtropical regions and is a rare infection in the US. People who have an impaired immune system, such as people with HIV, diabetes, or who have had an organ transplant, have an increased risk of contracting cryptococcal meningitis. Disseminated histoplasmosis, fungal infection in the body. Disseminated histoplasmosis is a rare fungal infection that can affect the body. It is caused by a type of fungus called histoplasma. This fungus is found in the soil in certain parts of the world, such as the Ohio and Mississippi River valleys, the American Midwest, and areas of South America. In general, it is not very common. But people who have an impaired immune system have an increased risk of contracting disseminated histoplasmosis. How does fluconazole work? Fluconazole inhibits the growth of fungus by blocking the production of certain proteins that are essential for the survival of fungal cells. It also increases the sensitivity of the fungus to naturally occurring chemicals in the body, such as free radicals. These effects cause the fungal cells to die. Fluconazole is also effective against other organisms that can cause infections in the body, such as bacteria. In some cases, it can be used as a single medication to treat a bacterial infection and a fungal infection at the same time. Benefits of Fluconazole It is effective in treating various types of fungal infections. It is available in both oral tablet and intravenous IV, forms. It is safe to use during pregnancy and in breastfeeding women. 
It is also generally safe to use in children. It has few side effects, although some people can experience side effects such as nausea, vomiting, abdominal pain, diarrhea, headaches, itching, or rash. Common Side Effects of Fluconazole Nausea This is a common side effect, usually occurring during the first few days of treatment. It can be treated with anti-nausea medications. Vomiting Vomiting is rare in people who take fluconazole. It can be treated with anti-nausea medications. Abdominal pain. This is a common side effect in people who take fluconazole. The pain can be treated with over-the-counter painkillers. Diarrhea. Diarrhea is a common side effect and can be treated with over-the-counter medications. Headaches. A headache is a common side effect in people who take fluconazole and can be treated with over-the-counter headache medications. Rash. Rash is a rare side effect, occurring in less than 1% of people who take fluconazole. How to take fluconazole? Fluconazole can be taken either with food or without food. If food does not interfere with the effectiveness of the medication, then it can be taken with or without food. If you are using oral fluconazole, the standard daily dose is 100 mg. This can be taken as one dose or split into two doses, 50 mg each, depending on the situation. You should take the first dose as soon as possible after you are diagnosed with a fungal infection. You should take the second dose 12 hours after the first dose. For people who are taking oral fluconazole to treat cryptococcal meningitis, the standard daily dose is 400 mg. This should be taken in two daily doses, 200 mg each, at least 12 hours apart. When to see a doctor? Fluconazole is not indicated for treating serious fungal infections, such as histoplasmosis or disseminated histoplasmosis. In general, you should see a doctor if you have symptoms of a fungal infection and you want to be treated with fluconazole. This can help prevent serious complications, such as meningitis, that can arise from these infections. If you are using fluconazole to treat a fungal infection, you should see a doctor if you experience any of the following side effects. Diarrhea that is severe or lasts longer than 48 hours. Abdominal pain that is severe or lasts longer than 48 hours. A headache that is severe or lasts longer than 48 hours. Rash that does not go away after two weeks. Thanks for watching.